I'm from Buenos Aires, Argentina. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Can you show us your name badge, please? Of course. Here. And you're from the University of Buenos Aires. Um, yeah, from the University of Buenos Aires and the National University of Luján, mm -hmm. another public university in Buenos Aires. Mm -hmm. I work uh, as a professor of environmental law, international environmental law, and now, from this year, um, also a, a social responsibility. It's okay. not a subject related to environmental issues. And you also mentioned that you're doing a PhD. Yeah, I finished my PhD, uh, mainly focused on water resources, uh, urban water resources. And your research has brought you to Stockholm? Sorry? Your research has brought you to Stockholm? Yeah, yeah. For this World Water Week? very interesting. Yeah, I found a lot of uh, very interesting presentations. Mm -hmm. I, um, I also made a presentation yesterday. Oh, what was that on? Um, it was about some social pro uh, programs uh, that um, the main uh, water company mm -hmm. from Buenos Aires mm -hmm. is doing uh, like from 10 years ago till now mm -hmm. and explain a bit about that. Wonderful. Uh, yeah. And what issue particularly interests you, um, a, a topic here at Water Week? Here, well, I'm maybe working on water crisis or water corruption and mm -hmm also uh, analyzing the, the social issues connected to it. And do you uh, focus on Argentina as yeah. a country? Okay. Which, um, is it as a whole country the same issues or are there particular no, spots? No, mainly in the city of Buenos Aires um, mm -hmm. and, compare it, and comparing it with another province, mm -hmm. which is nearby. Uh, but I also analyze in general terms, I, I compare with some um, cases in the world which are which has, have similar characteristics. As okay, those. what sorts of characteristics are those? For example, well, Latin America, we have a lot, a lot of cases which are cities that have the same problems like us. Um, they have the similar realities, mm -hmm. similar social issues. So mm -hmm. What really kinds of social issues would um, come to mind? Well, for example, one of the programs I explained yesterday in the presentation um, there, there's a lot of people who, um, well, they don't have uh, access to water, mm -hmm. to fresh water services. So um, we, we are um, in these countries. A lot of uh, the government, in, in jointly with some water companies or NGOs, well, like mm -hmm. all together, are working in social social problems mm -hmm. in order to help these people to have access to this. And they uh, created like a um, form of cooperatives where um, the same people in the community work for their own. Great. Uh, so they get they are they they are um, in the majority of cases they are unemployed, so they get a job and they also work for them. Mm -hmm. So they are, they are functioning very well. And so what lastly, what issue would you say in Argentina? Mm -hmm. um, you want people around the world to know about what water issue? Um, well, I think it's um, access to fresh water. Mm -hmm. uh, what the quality is it's improving. Mm -hmm. We are um, improving that. Uh, we are uh, analyzing uh, other cases, successful cases or, or situations in the world, and we are learning about them. Great. And I think people is more aware of these environmental issues than some years before. That's good to hear. Yeah. Thank you for coming in and taking some time to share with us. Okay, thank you. <laughs>